And that's how I ended up making out with my stepmother. Not a great idea in retrospect. You don't have many friends, do you, Odakan? Well, my stepmother seems to like me. Snake, you can both discuss this later. In group therapy. Were you listening to all that? He's a good kid, really knows his way around the internet forums. I'll bet. Snake, right now you're in base camp Delta Foxtrot, the suspected base of operations of Revolver Ocelot. I know where I am. I crawled here on my belly through a jungle's worth of mud, riding on top of a crocodile, which I subsequently ate. What did it taste like? Like alligator. Current intelligence says that Ocelot's tent is being guarded by a second-in-command, flamethrower Meerkat. Her dossier says that she's a delicately beautiful former juggler and assassin, whose parents were tragically murdered by a person who looked exactly like her, leading to a life of self-loathing. She's skilled in jujitsu, is mildly psychic, and if you kill her, she turns into rose petals and will be reborn in the next spring rain. Her dossier says she's delicately beautiful. I may have tossed in some unnecessary commentary. What are my entry points? You've got three avenues of attack, Snake. A direct assault will take you there fastest, but may leave you vulnerable to... And the second? Uh-huh. No, that won't work. I don't like cats. He's been like that for about ten minutes, just talking to himself. Should we shoot him or just draw stuff on him? I got a sharpie in my locker. Hey, ask Otakon if his stepmother has a sister. We're not talking about Dragon Quest. Final Fantasy X, brother, I know you haven't forgotten. Here's how you laugh, Yuna. Ha ha ha! 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 As always, your Tidus impersonation is uncanny, brother. Devil's advocate, though, is it not possible that scene was intended as satire? If you suck ironically, you still suck.